Hey, morning guys, Mike here, Affluent Journeys. We are at Marble Snow Park out here by Cougar, Washington. And this is the Bigfoot Trail Races. They have a 200 mile race, 40 mile race, and I'm doing the 20 mile race today, uh, up close around Mount St. Helens. So I hope you enjoy watching. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe here to the YouTube channel, hit like, uh, put your comments down below, and uh, give me a follow on Strava. Also on Facebook if you want to see my luxury cruise deals. All right, we'll be getting started here in a little bit. Here's the start of the 40 miler. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Guys, we're on the start of the Bigfoot 20. It's an easy race of the day. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm starting in about 10th place here. All right, I'm in about uh, eighth place now, about 0.8 miles in. And nobody in front of me is using poles, so nobody's behind me either. Pretty much it's a steady uh, uphill now for about 2,000 feet and four miles. So let's keep it rocking. Whoa. Two miles in, 22 minutes. There's the first look at Mount St. Helens. All right, 2.3 miles in, 28 minutes. And the leaders were just up there a second ago. Look at this, is steep here. So we gotta get around here somewhere. Big Creek. All right, two and a half miles in right there. We just made the turn onto the Lewitt Trail. So the sun will be at my back now. But we still have some more vert to do. I think it'll be a little bit flatter here though. Almost at 4,000 feet right now. So right here we're pretty much following the pink and blue flags. We're about mile 3.05, 40 minutes in. 4,054 feet of elevation. So about another mile and a half of ascent and then it's mostly flat and downhill the rest of the way. Foggy mountains. I'm wearing these Tecton X and my compression tights. A North Face uh, UV shirt and Solomon pack. We're four miles in. I got a fast guy here behind me. Uh, good and I'll catch him on the downhill. Uh, <laughs> the rock falls here. Beautiful terrain. I'm passing a lot of the uh, 40 milers. They're probably just kind of hiking. So I think I'm running ninth now behind that gentleman. But I'll catch him later. About four, point, four and a quarter miles in, 4,600 feet of vert, and I'm right behind the guy. Beautiful shaded forest section. I think we only have a little bit more vert, and that's pretty much it. Put the poles away. The 40, that's too hard. Thanks, guys. Catch me on YouTube later. There they are. Oh, I don't know. Uh, Alright, here we go. That's a rock field here. I'm not used to this. 
big rocks here you got to jump over navigating every step while filming that's like 10 feet down there this guy just passed me so I'm running 10th now but I'm gonna catch him too All right, we just came off the top there at about 46, 4,700 feet. I got passed again, so I think I'm down to 11th or 12th now. So I gotta do some work here to get back in shape. And then, so I gotta catch all these people so I can get a top 10 finish. I think I can do it. Catching up to that guy, I've got a big gully here to go through. And then it looks like up some more. All right, now I think we're off the top. Everybody's running down there. All right, seven miles in, one hour four. Cut this guy right here, so I'm back to 10th place. So all the nice cities are up. Uh, I think I'm 10th and I think you're 11th. It's all downhill from here. All right, let's rock. All right, we descended about uh, 900 feet there in about five minutes, I think. I was bombing away around six mile, six minute per mile pace there. 7.8 miles in. Lots of tree stumps, so we got to bump over. So eight and a quarter miles in, one hour 51. Past Andre again, so hopefully I'm in ninth place now. Maybe I can catch a couple more here. Got a long way to go. So now I decided to put the poles uh, behind me in the little pole straps. Hopefully they don't come loose. We're at 4,800 feet, now we're down to 3,800 feet. So that was a thousand feet of elevation. Drop in 10 minutes. All right, 10 miles in, we're about 3,400 feet. Elevation, two hours, nine minutes. We got a new ninth place. And Ben is somewhere back there a bit. What's your name? Hadas. Hi. Hadas. Hadas. Are you here? Mike. Mike, nice to meet you. All right. So Hadas doesn't like being in ninth place, but I'm going to try and take it back here in a minute. Yeah, All right. Sooner rather than later. About two miles out from the aid station. All right, behind me, here's the start of the Toodle Trail. And we're about 10.95 uh, miles in, which is a little over halfway, two hours, 19 minutes. About one mile from the aid station, maybe a little more. What's going on, boss? Hey. Some random guy out here. All right, they call everyone's dib when they come in. So I got here at uh, 11.37 miles, 2.23. Good aid stations with lots of good stuff. There's Ben. All right, so 11.86, 20 miler. This is the turn to the finish. I think here, somewhere. Here it is. Not much of a trail. Yeah, I think they said I was only three minutes behind the leaders. And I only saw three or four coming back out of the aid station on my way in, so. I mean, I'm a little further ahead than I thought. But I think I'm seventh or eighth right now. This trail doesn't get a lot of use, look at this. Oh, I just came through there by myself. 12.31 miles. Just coming through the dry riverbed here.
trying to stay by myself until hopefully I can catch up to the leaders. We'll see. We go. Flags are hard to see a bit. 12.68 miles, two, two hours 39. Beautiful forested grove here. Nice and cool. around. Oh, I see Ben coming up behind me. All right, 13.69, two hours, 51 minutes. Made it to Kalama Ski Trail. Uh, just about 10k to go in the three hours and nine minutes 15.12 miles oh we gotta go this way been further away from the mountain so that's good legs are a little tight but not terrible and the shoes are holding up really well so i can you know, feel the carbon plates a little bit Out of gels, but I have a few grapes and some carbs here. Uh, I'm getting low on the carbs still already. I think I'll make it. Now we're at uh, 16.44 in. We're doing our last big climb. The uh, guy back there around the corner said the leaders were about five minutes ahead of me, so with five miles to go. I don't think I'm gonna catch them. So I start walking. So this is our last kind of loop. Go uphill instead of downhill. There's a straight trail down there, but they're looping us the long way around. So hope they weren't cheating. Went down the short way. So I'm at mile 1750. She missed the aid station. So she's going back six miles, no, five or six miles uphill to go back to the aid station, which means now I'm one spot further ahead. So if I was eighth, now maybe I'm seventh. So bad for her and good for me. She's not carrying much water either. How's she gonna make it all the way up there? Wow. Uh, exactly 18 miles in, three hours, 38 minutes. So my 3.30 time goal is out the window. But we got, what, about 10K or 5K from here to finish. I'm just, that girl blew my mind. I didn't see her carrying any water. She's got to go back up six miles. Well, she gets a DNF or a DQ. All right, so that's Livy, I'm at mile 18.72. She thought the better of it and gave up. So she, she was in first place at the finish, but missed the aid station. So she's gonna be a DNF and she thinks I'm in fifth, but I think I'm in seventh. So I could be third male if there's four men in front of me. But off she goes, I guess she's a real pro or something. Bye. All right, two miles to go, three hours, 51. So maybe I'm fifth, seventh, something like that. All right, 19.55, three hours, 57. Really, of course, a little shorter than what I thought. Here we 
go, baby. Thank you. Hey. All right, I got third place male overall, so that's a surprisingly good result. Puppy. The trail's a little shorter than what I thought, so uh, if you haven't already, please make sure to hit like on the video, put your comments down below, subscribe here to Affluent Journeys, give me a follow on Strava. Uh, right now my account is um, uh, private, but you can still request to follow and I'll honor the request. And Adas came in like right behind me, like one or two minutes, and we're still waiting on Ben here to come in, so I don't see him yet. All right guys, here comes Ben. I got a trophy for you. Grant's got me, man. Oh, really? Good job, man. Thank you.